In my first video about this iMac, I established that running Mac OS X 10.6, it had quite a lot of problems even when it was only being used for basic tasks like surfing the web and watching movies. But when I asked myself, can Windows 7 revive this iMac? Before I start, I just want to mention that the main specs of this iMac are an Intel Core 2 Duo T7400, an Nvidia G4 7300 GT and 4GB of RAM. Let's begin with the installation process. I couldn't get this iMac to boot from any Windows installation medium at first, but when using an external hard drive with refit installed, I managed to install Windows 7. Following that I only needed to install the drivers that are supplied by Apple and additional NVIDIA drivers. From then on it actually worked without any problems. I had no problems installing any of the programs I needed and it just worked. The first thing I tried was web surfing and the iMac handled that one nicely and also a lot better than when it ran Mac OS X. Websites were loading quicker and scrolling was a lot smoother. Video playback works better as well with only a couple of frame drops from time to time and when switching between the different viewing modes. I should also mention that the kind of website you are trying to load also makes a difference. Google News loads a lot faster and works smoother than, for example, Facebook. This is due to the rather huge amount of data the PC has to process when running Facebook compared to Google News. Continuing on, office work is a lot easier to do as well with faster loading times and less stutter. I'd bet that Word 2016 would run smoothly as well, but sadly it does not support Windows 7. For my tests I use LibreOffice which is a free Microsoft Office alternative. From presentations to Excel calculations everything worked just fine. Next topic, local media consumption. This is also a strong point in Windows 7. Of course all your music will play nicely, but even when playing back full HD video it worked most of the time. This leads perfectly into our next topic, creative work. This is where the iMac 2006 starts to fail. You do not want to run any video or photo editing software on here at all and even sound work is everything but a joy to do. The only program that works somewhat ok is GIMP but I don't really like GIMP so from my point of view it still fails in terms of creative work. The last topic is something you might not have expected, gaming. Yes, you can actually game on this iMac and you can even game decently. Of course it doesn't run new released games on high settings and native resolution, but when playing older games or newer lighter games you can actually get pretty decent frame rates. I made a dedicated video about gaming in which I included a couple of benchmarks and you can check that one out by clicking in the link on the top right corner. But after all this, what can I conclude? Does Windows 7 revive this iMac? The answer is yes, totally. It's actually kind of funny that this iMac runs better on Windows than it does on the operating system it was designed for, but that might be because the newest OS X that this one runs has not been supported for about 5 years by now and Windows 7 is still the most used desktop operating system in the world. That's it for today, I hope you liked this video and I hope you'll continue watching my videos on this channel. Until then, bye.